In this video, for the first time ever, I am using a completely different platform to play Minecraft on. You guys have been commenting, asking me to make this video for years, so I'm finally doing it here today. If we manage to break 3,000 likes, then I will make a part two of playing on this version of Minecraft. I'm also going to be giving away one Lunar Client Cape in this video. All you have to do to enter is comment your IGN down below, like this video, and you must be subscribed. I will pick a winner in the next video for the Lunar Such speed client cape but anyway let's get into it hey what's going on guys such speed here and you have no idea how long i have been waiting and how long this has taken to set up so today as you can see we are not playing on your normal version of minecraft we're not playing on 1.8 we're not playing on 1.15 today we are going to be attempting for the first time ever on this channel to try out the windows 10 version of minecraft now before we get into any gameplay i want to quickly go into why i think this version of minecraft is a bit of a scam and i don't say that word lightly i genuinely feel like this is a little bit of a scam now i haven't actually played windows 10 version of minecraft in probably two or three years the last time i played it was 1v1 in rage elixir i'm pretty sure and that was so long ago so as you can see in the bottom right i have my little character here i i've got myself a little mask and uh, some gloves i didn't create this skin somebody from my stream created it and it's the only skin i had on my desktop at the ready so i just enabled it so uh, at least we're going in protected today if i go into the set i don't have any texture packs now the fun fact about minecraft on this version of minecraft you can no longer just add your own texture packs in fact they tease you with these packs here but you can do nothing with them you just simply click on them it, it, it you can click view in store you, you can't just get these packs which you'd assume you know they'd be displaying them because they're free or something right now as you can see the only texture pack i have right now is the default one and when you when you click on get more packs or click on my packs you have to go to the marketplace now if you go to all of the texture packs in minecraft and you go to the filter and you know you don't necessarily want to spend any mine coins you don't have any you just want a cool texture pack and you click free well well, this is what you're getting if you click free you get two texture packs which is one the classic texture pack and the minecraft texture update beta so this is literally the default pack you can no longer get texture packs in minecraft unless you're paying for them which i wasn't aware of i had no idea this was a thing but i just want to just say like why why is that a thing you can play java edition and literally install any texture pack or anything you want but in bedrock they're they're now making you try and pay for all of it but it doesn't just stop there you'd like to think there isn't that many people on bedrock edition but if you go to servers right and you look at the hive just wait for it guys just wait you, you remember the hive right the hive had 2000 on here it has 21,000 players and cubecroft has 11,000 mineplex has 6,000 this is literally the resurrection of of so many servers i i've heard lifeboat is also really good now as you can see here at the bottom quad if you guys remember the quad video i, I i'm sure a lot of you are probably too young to know what quad means but basically uh, put put the meme on screen basically Basically, there was a long time ago, there was some videos uploaded to YouTube where people would go to random gatherings and buildings and just stream, scream quad. I remember, I remember this because I think somebody did it in my school when I was in like, when I was in like year eight or something. So that's pretty cool. So today I'm going to be exploring the quad server. Now, interestingly, you can connect to this server on the Java edition Minecraft on the latest version of 1.15. The IP is on the screen right now. This is the IP if you want to connect through the Windows 10 edition. Okay, and I just logged on and everything looks relatively normal apart from my cords which are just somehow in the top middle of the screen which i don't know why they're there can i move them i i don't understand oh my god this is the chat hello okay i can't even type in chat can i type hello oh i can type in chat damn so such speed pc there you go can't press tab in this version what happened to tab dude you can no longer press tab dude i miss it okay and oh my god there's someone on here so you can see player tags through walls in this version which is uh which is pretty interesting oh it's ikea 12 yo what's up ikea ikea 12 wow i actually just ordered something off ikea yesterday you guys can uh, i'll let you guess in the comments what that is but as you can see i've got my cute little skin here now apparently when you run and jump on this server it's oh my god oh my god <laughs> dude dude my character literally doesn't care he's literally just bouncing around like he's just like yo what's up yo did i miss anything what's up guys <laughs> dude that looks so weird okay so anyway as you can see here on the server this is 
actually pretty cool. I feel I feel like it's slightly directional. Okay, so it appears it's just me and IKEA 12 online today. And I, I believe it's kind of directional. Where like when I look around, it's actually it's actually pretty cool. So as you can see, rock in default because Minecraft wanna pick into my pocket and take my money for a texture pack, which which I can't do. I, I can't give in to that. I'm sorry. I will not be buying any mob coins in this video. But let me know if they're worth purchasing. Maybe in the future we'll do a mob coin unboxing. No, I'm kidding. That's a terrible idea. But let's get into the earth realm okay me and this chat up here on the left are gonna have serious problems because it's literally taking up my screen but the the position okay editor i i know you're listening right now let's try and get rid of the position for the remainder of the video no i'm kidding that's probably impossible but it is just a big eyesore for me so anyway as you can see here welcome to earth where adventure begins so this is the earth realm on quad now i'm gonna go ahead and jump into this teleporter because basically you're about to witness greatness guys i'm about to go traveling across the world so before my minecraft completely crashed we were standing at the front of this teleporter now i'm about to go through and show you on 1.15.2 what's supposed to happen now as you can see when you connect you are given the option to go to several continents now you can go to south america you can go to europe you can go to australia you can go to africa i'm personally going to be going to africa as you can see i've just tra traveled to africa and the biome is set up to kind of mimic or replicate what it's like in real life as you know a lot of africa is the desert it's it's very it's very warm there in fact i really want to go to africa sometime should we make that happen now i'm going to challenge you guys the first person to come and find my base in africa will receive one such speed lunar client cape code i'm going to literally place a code in the ground at my base where if you're man if you manage to find my base i will make it very obvious where, where my base is by the way the cords right now are probably a good hint i'm going to be making the base roughly where my cords are right now now so if you want to come in you know if you want to come and tp it will tp you randomly i also wanted to quickly say i have a discount code going on right now for the quad store which you can get items to help you further become richer on the server and also come and find my base so anyway i'll leave my code down below in the description you can use it for a discount i believe it's 20 percent off but also the first person to come and find me redeem the code leave your name here i will make sure to give you a rank in my discord but let's continue so i thought it would be quite rude not to try out survival games on this version of minecraft and oh my god this is really weird okay we got a diamond sword off of spawn this is game but there is a cooldown so we can't really go for some spawn kills because we're playing on survival games 4 i should know what i'm doing on this map this this map's actually pretty popular i was expecting to try something new but nope on on this version of minecraft it's still the most popular map the good thing about it is that i know pretty much every route on this map so i know where players are going to go and these guys are waiting for the pvp grace period to stop and it's understandable because i'm just going to come in here with the cleanup crew with the with the cleanup crew okay uh that was that was very very rude okay let's get these legs and boots on where'd this guy go this guy's an actual dragon running away from me his skin is so cool if you see this guy's skin he's shifting at me so as you can hear whenever whenever somebody dies it just sounds like you're taking a screenshot or something like it, that's literally what it sounds like and it's it's actually pretty scary but this guy is just running away here running for his life you can see name tags through walls like so clearly okay i don't know how i managed to land two hits on that guy don't question it we're gonna run over to the hangar here real quick or i say run but like what is this what, what is this animation is straight out of roblox like for real okay so we're currently at the hangar and i don't know everything looks really blurry in this version of minecraft i don't know if that's just like my settings or what exactly but we're gonna sneak up on this guy real quick maybe even put him in actually no we're gonna eat this chicken here real quick here we go what is this guy called there's no optifine i can't zoom on this guy the, the struggles are real okay this guy's called sneery man x okay yo what's up sneery man i just hit him with that one that's so unfortunate we literally just got him in such a good cobweb there <laughs> okay so sneery man x didn't last too long but but i don't know how many people are even in this game like you can't even tell I, I genuinely feel bad because i feel like i'm going up against players who use like an xbox controller to play minecraft but then you have this guy who's who's got got himself a cape got himself diamond boots and it just makes me rethink how i'm gonna win this game i mean i'm gonna have to go for him i have to that's my competition right there he's got himself a cape though which makes me think he's actually not bad at this game i'm just gonna bow him to death okay here we go he's 
it three. Oh my god, he's dead. Okay, he's he's one heart. He's one heart. Oh my god. Wait, wait. Bows do so much on this server. What is it? I killed him. There we go. We got Ayumi out of the game. That guy was so stacked. Oh my god, he had spare diamond boots and a spare diamond sword. What is this guy's stuff? Okay, I'm just gonna run away. So I kind of bow spammed him, but you know, I needed to collect I needed to collect that W. I mean it had to be done, dude. This version of Minecraft has me so paranoid because if, if you can't tell by the sound, everything is like delayed slightly. So when you're running, it sounds like somebody's chasing you, but it's literally just your own sounds. Is there anything? Okay, I'm just gonna put all of this stuff in here because I don't even need it at this point Like I have three diamond swords. It's just it's unnecessary I have two sets of boots when you go in your inventory and you, you keep jumping you keep jumping like as you can see I'm clearly not jumping or anything But minecraft still thinks I am which which is something that needs to get fixed Possibly I mean it's not necessarily an advantage, but here we go guys We're going into deathmatch on windows bedrock. We're about to witness a, a full fight here We got four players remaining. So here we go. So this guy's got absolutely nothing the uh, same with the other guy so this guy's going for this guy i'm just gonna hit hit this guy off the edge can you hit players off the edge in here i, I don't really understand how it works oh we got that guy we don't even need his loot i don't think bogdan dimmy can he see me i mean i'm shifting he can't actually okay yeah he couldn't see me there he oh bogdan bogdan <laughs> bogdan dude i feel like i need to give this guy the win oh he's He's playing on 40 FPS right now. Well, there's Steve skin. He does, he's not he's not shifting while running. Yo, what's up, man? Oh my god, he's coming at me. <laughs> Dude, it must look so weird when you're running away on this server from players. Like, they must just see you running like this. Like, <laughs> this guy's pulled out the bow. He's on half a heart. Oh my god, he's on half a heart. We're gonna have to cookie this guy to death. It has, it has to be done, Bogdan. I'm afraid it has to be done. Oh, never mind. Sweet victory. I got the six kills. Oh my god, it's my skin. I'm huge though. Such speed first place. Can you see this? Hold up. Dude, I am huge. <laughs> that is so funny. Wow. All right, guys, and that's going to be it for today's video. If you guys want me to try out Windows 10 again, then let me know in the comment section. This was very interesting, and it's definitely something I want to try out in the future. So if you'd like to see me make more videos, you know, possibly on Windows 10, let me know in the comments down below. Aside from that, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Yeah.